My name is Rifilwe Mulife. People prefer to call me Fifi. I'm 63 years old now. I started that farm in 2006 because I saw there was a need in my community. I just thought I can just make a little difference. Mama Fifi's noble plans turned into a thriving urban farm producing bumper crops on two acres of land where she installed an irrigation system, erected greenhouse tunnels and built a packing facility. Her project provided produce to seven soup kitchens, won several awards and led to an agri-skills training program for thousands of university students. When you compete with the youth, you will always learn new things. So they were teaching me to start knowing that what I'm doing, it is called organic. I enjoyed being in that class because it made me grow so much. Part of Mama Fifi's successful enterprise was selling products from a fresh produce, which in turn helped finance her Beatrice project. I have to add value to my products. Then I started agro-processing, started making healthy juices, and I also made chili sauces with the chili I plant. On 6 June, workers from the city of Johannesburg bulldozed Mama Fifi's urban farm to make way for a contentious multi-purpose centre with a proposed budget of 240 million rand. Ironically, the plan includes an urban farm on the site. The move has been criticised by more than 60 local NGOs and activists. I was destroyed. I was torn into pieces. Especially thinking about the people who are coming to buy 10 rand spinach because people are not working. The city of Johannesburg has since allocated a piece of land to Mama Fifi in Aikenhof, 20 kilometers away, a distance she says that will remove her from her soup kitchens and clientele. But two charities have since offered land close by to Mama Fifi, whose ardent supporters regard her as one of South Africa's most successful urban farmers. And I'm very lucky to find them because we have got the same mentality like mine, who love what I love, and they are really hands-on.